the PWC Chase. His next is a Grade 3 over 2 miles and 1 further. And at the top we've got the King for Joshua Sutherland. They're ranting out for Graham Clutterbuck. Both of those won last week. Wade Bridge, Darren Thompson, that won the week before. Weary Woody for Kevin Meenan also won in the first week of the season. African Bloom, Stu Gray, Alien Invasion, Leon Van Rinsburg, American Pickers and Angel of Darkness for Paul Rhodes, Ashura Posh for David Robertson, by chance David Hooley, a week one winner, Kaylee's Wald for James Shea, China Girl, Alex Cherry, Lucinia Stalina, Craig Beckwith, Matisse Dabawi, David Robertson and the Smiler, Joshua Sutherland, 15 there in this, and away they go, probably one of the bigger fields of the week I would think, and it's going to be the grey Kaylee's Wald who's going to go into the early lead towards the first of nine fences they've got to negotiate in this Lucina Stalina is in second and then the rest of them spread right across the track with African Bloom just the early back marker but it's Kaylee's World who's got the lead from Lucinia Stalina in second and by chance has moved through into third place Weary Willie after that one in fourth Matisse de Bowie, and China Girl and Wade Bridge, the ranting aunt, who's next as they finally get to the first, which they're all safely over. With the two all road horses towards the back of the field at this point, as they take the second, he's got his Obi Wan colours on in this race. And it's Kaylee's Wald and Lucinia Stellina who dispute the lead then, as they caught past the stand with a Complete circuit still ahead of them. And Kaylee's ball to ground the inside of the Sinia Stellina in second. Those two are disputing the lead. Gap of four lengths back to Weary Woody in the green jacket in third. Then a line of three or four of them. Matisse de Barwe by chance and Wade Bridge with the ranting arm after them. The two Joshua Southern horses running together. The King and the Smiler. Alex Cherry's China Girl and the Orange has now just switched to the rail. Going to try and get a split between David Hooley's horse and the rail, I think, or maybe between David Hooley and Darren Thompson's horse, but if I prefer to go that way than the outside. I'm struggling to find some racing room at the minute. But they get to the third. And they're all safely over the third then with Lucinia Stellina now having won the battle to lead over Kayleigh's Wald who's back in second. They get to this ditch. Which they all stream over nicely. The field is still pretty tightly packed with the exception of these two leaders and the back marker African Bloom who's out of shot as they get to the fifth. And they're all safely over. Oh, they're not because Angel of Darkness has gone. I was just about to say they're all safely over it. And the jockey went out the side door. Lucinia Stellina made a bad mistake there, went in the lead, and that's left Kaylee's Wall back in front. They get to another ditch and over that one. They go on as a crashing fall there for Matista Bawi. And Matista Bawi's gone in the pack, and the King has now come through to challenge Kaylee's Wall for the lead. Then comes Alien Invasion. The Smiler still running wide on the track. Ashura Posh is still going well. Lucinia Stellina trying to get going again. By chance is next. And then China Girl looking for room. Weary Woody's lost his place. Then comes Wade Bridge. The Ranting Arts also struggling a bit round the outside there. But dropping right out of it. American Pickers African Bloom. But it's Kaylee's Wald and the King who are disputing the lead. They've only got two more fences to take. And three more furlongs to race. And the grey Kaylee's Wald on the inside. From the King on the outside. Over it they go. And the King out jumped. Kaylee's Wald got back into the lead. It's the King who's gone on from Kaylee's Wald. But now coming through with a strong looking run. Is Wade Bridge and Alien Invasion. Over the final fence they go. And it's suddenly it's the King and Alien Invasion. It's the King on the near side. Alien Invasion over on the far side. They've still got a furlong to go. And the King the top weight. He's beginning to pull away again. It's the King in the lead. From Alien Invasion. Who's moved through in a second. Then by chance going up the centre of the track now, who's in the second, and the smile is running through as well, but it looks like he's going to be the king that's going to take it, up towards the line, the king takes it from by chance in second, and the smile are sure a posh finish, well a field will trail back to African Bloom who finishes in his own time, and it's a pretty decent performance that by the winner, the king, who's taken it, and the King for Joshua Sutherland is the winner. By a chance for David Hooley second. The Smiler for Joshua Sutherland was third. Then Ashura Posh for David Robertson was fourth. And Alien Invasion for Leon Van Rensburg was fifth.